Guys, we're here with the Nug Smasher IQ. This machine is absolutely amazing. Um, this is what uh, the engineers have brought us. They brought us a decarb mode on this thing, which we're testing out here. Basically, um, uh, there's a decarb for THCA or CBD here. We went, went ahead and uh, put some isolate in the uh, small decarb capsule. We put it between the plates. We selected, went to the decarb mode up here, the decarb icon and we just simply hit go. Um, it, it heated up to 240 degrees um, for 25 minutes. Uh, you can see we're 20 minutes in. Uh, there's four minutes and 40 seconds left on, on the, uh, the timer here. And once it runs out, it's gonna let the plates cool down to 125 degrees uh, it, before it, it all while it's maintaining pressure so it doesn't explode and uh, once it, it, it cools down to 125 degrees under that pressure it go it, the plates go ahead and release the uh, pressure and we'll be able to uh, pull the decarb out so anyhow pretty neat it'll be on the first update of the uh, Nug Smash Fry Q and right after this uh, we're going to go ahead and uh, isolate seven and a half grams of rosin uh, in the Nug Smash Fry Q We've been having a lot of fun with that we got a lot of a lot of isolate around and it's absolutely amazing solventless isolate um, it's absolutely amazing so stick with us okay guys so you can see the, the actual plate temperature is down here in the small writing but the decarb has ended but it's still hot so you know obviously we're taking that into consideration if you pulled it out right now you hit stop you pulled it out right now it, it would explode on you there's a lot of pressure inside uh the capsule that's one of the secrets to our decarb capsule how it decarbs uh, like it does so anyhow um the fan's on you can see it turns the fan on and it it blows air across the plates it's cooling the plates uh, down as we speak when it gets to 125 degrees it'll release pressure on the plates and we'll know to come and get it so you can take your decarb out it's completely cool what we did is we decarbed some uh, pure isolate and turned it into some completely decarbed diamonds and that's what you're looking at here. It's completely crystallized, we'll let it cool down and we'll pull it out and break it out and it'll be nice crystallized glassy diamonds. Mm -hmm. 